good. Okay, we're rolling. And uh, oh, I don't have a nickname for you. What's your nickname going to be? Ew, I don't know. Um, TT. No. No. Okay. That's no good. Flute. No. No. I wasn't asking you. Well, you know, you got to make up one real You're quick. You're the one in here trying to make up all the rules and everything. I have. You're not her mother. You're not her girlfriend. I'm her sister. Well, that doesn't mean that, you know, you're in charge of her. <laughs> I'm taking care of her. Well, and now i got to wear a mask. Somebody has to because she can't even sit up. I know. Oh, you poor thing. You don't look like you feel any good. So we'll try not to give you too much, you know, grief about this. You look pretty, you look pretty down on your luck. Yeah. You look like you just spent your last dollar on a horse race and uh, your horse came in fourth or something. You know what I mean? <laughs> How long have you been sick? It started yesterday. It just hit you like a brick wall? Yep. Okay. And aches, pains, fevers, chills? Yes. All right. Uh, a little bit of cough, maybe some sore throat? Yes. Okay. And did you get a flu shot this year? Yes. You did get a flu shot. Okay. And um, have, you, have you measured your temperature? Yes. How high was it? One oh one. Yeah. So I, I know the results of your flu test. Yeah, they told me already. The, you mean they <laughs> They took away my fun. You're positive for type A and B. What does that even mean? Well it means you're infected with two strains of the flu. Is that why I feel like shit? Yeah, that would be uh, pretty pretty close to explaining it, yeah. Yeah, you actually have two strains of the flu, and it's making you really feel tired. So it really makes you feel like you've been, you know, knocked for um, a loop. Yeah, that was pretty good. Knocked for, knocked for a loop, right? Okay, so here's the thing. Um, you're within the first 24 hours of getting sick, so you've got a real good chance that the flu medication is actually going to help you, okay? Number two, you're going to stay home and you're going to rest. You're probably not going anywhere today, but... You may start feeling better tomorrow, and you may want to get out and start doing things. And I don't want you to do that. I want you to stay home and rest for a few days. So if you need a note for work or school or anything, let us know, okay? I know you're probably in finishing school right now, and you probably haven't made it to the uh, appropriate language in the doctor's office section yet. But that's okay. You have notes. You're on your way. Uh, maybe not. <laughs> I know, she's really not sure whether it's funny or not, because she, she looks like she's, <laughs> she's going to cry, but she's, but she's trying to, you know, uh, but anyway, so I want you to stay home and rest, drink lots of fluids. The key to drinking enough fluids so you know that you're getting enough is if you have to get up and go to the bathroom every hour and a half, you're drinking enough fluids, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, another thing you can do is you can alternate Tylenol and Advil. So you take two Tylenol three hours later, take two Advil three hours later, go back to two Tylenol three hours later, back to two Tylenol, and you get the idea. Mm -hmm. If you alternate those every three hours, you're actually getting the same medicine every six hours, so it's safe, safely dosed that way. It will take away your aches and pains. It'll take away your fevers and chills, and it will remove your malaise. That is your feeling of just general, I don't feel good. You'll get your energy back, and you'll feel like sitting up and you know, watching some reruns of, I don't know, what does she like to watch? What the heck do you watch? Gilligan's Island? Ew. Anyways. The Monsters? What the hell? They're old. That is old school. Are you saying, wait, did we you used say to watch old? it? Well, we used to watch it. Oh, wow. Okay. I, I don't think it's on TV. So, you know, um, House Hunters? Do you, are you into that stuff? No. She doesn't even want to talk. Mm-mm. -hmm. You sure it's okay if we video you for, for our friends? <laughs> I don't even care at all. Bless your heart. All right. Um, so hydration and take the medicine okay. we're going to give her. And um, so when you get to the pharmacy and you get the prescription, go ahead and take the first pill right then. Okay? okay. And then take the second one tonight if they give you the Tamiflu, which is most likely what she's going to get. Um, there is another prescription, but a lot of insurance companies don't cover it. And a lot of the pharmacies don't have it yet. Some, sort of a new medicine this year. So uh, count on getting the Tamiflu. So get the first one in the pharmacy, and then the second one will get home tonight. Um, and make sure you uh, stay hydrated. Again, the thing that gets most people sicker where they end up, and I mean young, health, otherwise healthy people, right. that end up in the hospital is they, they, don't, get, they don't stay hydrated. They let themselves okay. get dehydrated, and they just feel so miserable um, that they end up going to the emergency room, and then they, you know, they do some blood work, and they get tanked up with uh, three liters of fluid, and then they feel a lot better, and they send them home. So... Um, we don't want that to happen to you, okay? Well, bless your heart. Get well, and um, 
are, are really um, I'm gonna, you're, you're completely forgiven for the use of bad language in here, but not in the hallway. That we, we can't let that one go. So. <laughs> You will have to you will have to put a dollar in the square bucket on the way out. You wouldn't know what's gonna happen. She's not gonna walk down the hallway. She's gonna be like, no, don't. <laughs> silent. No, don't, don't. All right. Thanks for being a sport. Get well, okay? Check out Dr. Gilmore's seven-piece kit. It's compact in size with a leather case, perfect for traveling, and available on Amazon for under twenty dollars. See link below. Hey folks, you spoke and we listened. Here's what you had to say about Meta 7. I love it so much. It gives me so much energy during the day. I've noticed a change in my hair, my nails, my blood pressure. There's no doubt that it, it's, it's a benefit to me. It gives me more stamina. And it can actually help you lose weight. Now, I haven't taken a nap in six months. That's right, Meta 7. More and more people are sending in their testimonials. Weight loss, more energy, and generally feeling more alert during the day. Let's hear more. I used it to help wean myself off caffeine and energy drinks, and my productivity has been very high lately. It's natural, it's amazing. I feel motivated to get out and do things that I didn't before. I'm not tired during the day. I've worked 12 hour shifts. Just go, go, go all day. It makes me feel great, I love it, and um, take it. It's wonderful stuff. If you haven't tried Meta 7 yet, it's time to order yours from Amazon. Time to boost your metabolism and kick your energy level into high gear. There's an Amazon link in the description.